what's up guys i'm back i want to share with you guys real quick a little routine i've been working on for maybe the last two weeks or so i don't think i recorded it i don't know but it's um you know another muscle up preparation little routine it consists of um jump pull-ups jump muscle ups and then negative muscle ups you know it's kind of like this video is for people like me who don't have a you know like those bands you know to help you a little bit a little boost to do the pull-ups so i just want to let everybody know that if you don't have one of those to help you out don't get discouraged you know you could do jump up jump up muscle up which is you just jump up to the bar you know it's kind of the same thing anyways i'm gonna do five rounds of um jump up muscle ups and then five rounds of negative muscle ups five each so um, in between we'll rest 30 seconds and those 30 second rest we'll do some rocking chair all right so we're mimicking the muscle up here try not to use that mess for your feet but your feet are gonna help you get that little boost and then help you get over the bar to that transition from that pull to that dip so it's like this One. That's two. Three. Four. And five. Take a little active rest here. We'll do 30 seconds. We'll make this video too long. Jump up. Two down. Thirty seconds. And I'm doing I'm doing this routine after a, a push routine. So, but that's the goal to try to do this movement, you know, the muscle up movement while you're fatigued. Three down, two to go. Okay, we're focusing on the movement, on the technique, working on that transition from that pull to the dip. Just repeating that movement over and over. So I've been doing this routine for the last two weeks, maybe not every day, but almost every other day. 
And recently I've been doing it almost yeah, every other day. As soon as I'm done with the routine, whatever it is, boom, usually it's a pull <laughs> or a push or, or both. But we'll throw this in at the end. Now we're trying to explode up and be realistic. Don't jump up to the bottom way to your stomach. I like doing it, bring the bar at least to my chest. Cause when I do the pull, I know I could pull at least up to my chest. And now we're just working on that transition. I did this set the other day. Started off with 15 pull-ups with two two sets of 15 pull-ups. Now I was able to do them on broken. I hadn't done that in a long time, so low key that was I felt really good inside about that. So that just tells me that I'm getting closer. I'm getting closer. All right, last one. Remember, starting from here, as soon as you go up, try to keep your legs straight, just like you were hanging from a from a pull-up bar. As soon as I come up here, I'm making that kind of like a, a letter C movement, where I kind of start here, and then I'm gonna read myself over the bar and then make that dip. So it kind of I'm kind of coming up like this. All right, let's get it. Thirty seconds. Here. I'm good. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, thank you. Nice. Thank you. I have I have some water. Do you have one of those things? Appreciate it. Cool. I've seen it in the fucking the new fucking best way to use your fucking underpants. <sighs> Is it in the screenshots? Yeah, like a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit. I want to do some negatives. Starting from the top and going down. Slowly down, as slow as possible. One. Four. And five. One down. Start the time. 
That was one round. We're gonna do that five times. 30 second rest in between. With some active rest. We need some active chairs. Four. Man, these are tough. There's a muscle up in reverse. One five. Two down. Thirty seconds. The slower you go on the on those negatives, the tougher it is. Doesn't look like much, but they don't got me out of breath, but I'm breathing a little hard. Doesn't look like much, like I said, but it requires some strength, you know? Strength that I want to get, so I'm doing them. Go for the next five. One. It's two. Three down. Too close. Two more here. Thirty seconds. Yeah, just a little active rest. We're still keeping the core engaged with a little stomach strike. Just a reminder. Keep that core tight. No matter what the exercise is. That's your center of gravity. exercise is good for you know just to keep the core engaged get those hamstrings stretched all right Three. 
before. <clears throat> Four down. That's last round coming up. But first, 30 seconds, active rest with some rocking chairs. You can count them on if you want. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, two. One, two, three, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, five. Thumbs up. Last round. Let's get it. Slippery. That was two. Three. Four. Ooh. Last one. And five. Finish it off with thirty seconds. Rocking chair. So no rest. It's all work right now. Three seconds up. All right, I'm gonna share with you the last one. Some tricep extensions. Back row. Back to back, 10 tricep extensions, 10 back rows. That was five, five more.
That was three down. Two more. There's a cool down. For a finisher. Doesn't look like much, but after you've done a little push routine. Get a good little good little pump, good little burn. Remember to squeeze. Pretend you're trying to rip the bar apart at the at the top when you do these back rolls. When you get the bar to the chest, just pretend you or imagine you're trying to rip the bar, you know? Tear it in two pieces for a quick second. You, when you get to the top, just, just pretend you're trying to rip it apart. That's when you get that little that little burn. There it is. There it is. If you never try that, give it a shot. There's a difference between just pulling and then the difference between pulling and then doing that little that little tear at the top. That rip. There it is, another quick little routine. You know, we did some jump up muscle ups that kind of mimics doing muscle ups with a resistant band, you know, to get a little help. What that does is how we're doing is working on that movement, working on the technique, working on that transition, you know, from the pull to the pull, to the push, and then from the pull to the dip, and then you do the muscle up. So that's what we're focusing on, that's what I'm focusing on. So just little by little, we're chipping away. Those negatives, those are really tough too. But again, it mimics the, the muscle up movement. Again, you know, the hardest part right now where I feel my weakness is at that transition. And that's what I'm working on. That's why I'm doing these routines. You know, I'm trying to, that little, I, I got the pulls. I know I could probably do one muscle up at least, but I feel like I'm getting, I, could, I already know I could do 15 pull ups. So that tells me I could, if I could do that, and um, I would get to those, I'm trying to get those single bar dips in, more dips, you know, get those triceps and then get that transition. And I'm, I'm focusing on strengthening those areas. And then um, hopefully, you know, by the end of this year or, or by 2022, we'll get those muscle ups. And we'll have some muscle up routines coming. Man, that's my goal. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Thank you for your positive comments and uh, for supporting. You know, this channel I built it, started it over a decade ago, and um, don't have a lot of followers, but that's cool. That's not the point, you know. If I have followers, that's cool, because a lot of people, more people will watch it. But if I could just get one person, if I could just motivate one person from whoever watches this, if I could just motivate one person, then my mission is accomplished. You know, that's my, that's one of my missions. You know, to work out post the videos and then people see it and they get motivated or they get inspired and they themselves want to go out and exercise you know that's my mission if i could do that for one person then my job is done so but anyways for the few that stick around you know and you give me your support thank you i appreciate i appreciate and i appreciate love all of you <sighs> anyways nice little pump today Let's keep getting it in. Let's chip away, little by little. We got this. I believe in you. Let's get it.